Okay, so it's end of April 2018, and the sun is up high in the sky this time of year. So we're gonna see what kind of performance we get out of this batch heater under these better conditions. Okay, so I'm gonna start by closing off the uh, solar batch heater. So that way we won't be using any of that water today. All right, so it's about 8.30 in the morning, and we're at about 82 degrees. That'll be our starting temperature. Okay, so it's about 10 a.m. And let's see what kind of temperature we get out of here. Okay, so first we'll check the inlet temperature. Looks like it's about 73. All right, then let's check the hot water. Like it's about 90. So it's about 11:30, and today has been partly cloudy so far. Maybe not the best day to test this. Let's we'll see what we got. Uh, looks like about 93. So it's 2:30, and it's still in the sun. Let's see what we get here. Uh, it looks about 100. And 30 and it's in the shade now okay 430 and it looks like a hundred and five okay so next up I want to see how much hot water we have so I've hooked a hose onto here and I got a bucket so I'm gonna just fill up these five gallon pails buckets and we'll see how hot it is too. And I'm gonna dump it in the pool. Five gallons at 109. Let's see what we got here. 108. Maybe 99. The next five gallons is 93. Maybe 89, 86. Okay, the next five gallons is 83. And the next five gallons is 82. So it dropped off fast in the beginning, but now it's stabilizing. 80. 79, 78, 77. Okay, so this five gallons is about 77. That's the last one I'm gonna do. The water coming in here is probably 73 or four. Okay, so if we take a cross section of our 50 gallon water heater, we had in five gallon increments, we had 109 at the top, 108, going on down to, to uh, 79 degrees at the bottom. Okay, so I recorded this about a couple of weeks ago, and now we're out to about mid-May, and got even more sun. Tank continues to get hotter up to 123 degrees now by the end of the day. Uh, this chart shows going back to February, uh, we had a little cold snap here, and but it's steadily been climbing. I think it'll go up a little bit more, level off, and we should get may probably get a little bell curve here, and it'll probably head back down the same way. So I'll probably do an update on this um, at the end of the year so we get a full chart. That's it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.